Hey there, folks. I'm Zerfall. Oh, hey, I'm Bubble the Vulture. <laughs> and welcome back to Final Fantasy. Oh, okay. Where there's nothing more final or fantastic than an airship. Can you know, we haven't visit visited... Uh, yeah. yeah. Nothing here. <laughs> you have no more business here. Go! Oh! GTFO! Oh, man. Okay, we did get these. I always forget yeah. that you can walk in the skulls. Yes. You always, like, try and avoid them, and then you're like, wait, no, they're perfectly fine. And you're like, now that I have an airship, I can probably go over these skulls and get those treasures. Yeah, that's what it is. I think mm, this is the... This place is uh, buried in deep, deep woods. Yeah, we're gonna have to... That's the village you were talking about. Can you park on the southern... Oh. Can you park on just the tip there in the south? Oh, this little... No, that's a... No, that's Because there's square water. tiles, right? So you gotta have a full-on... Alright, so go to the... Go all the way... I'm pretty sure they just meant that you can't do it. Like, yeah, there's no room there, right? They made this one a challenge uh, on purpose. So that you would have to fight all the Plufort enemies. Because that is the peninsula... Or that's the, the other side of the water from the Peninsula of uh, Power, right? Yeah, maybe we aren't going to these guys anytime soon. Penins Peninsula Blue Fort. Oh man, I can't just like land there and get in the canoe? Actually... Nah, dog. That's the one spot. You see it? Oh, well, yeah. That's that's it. That's your parking place. Well, let's go this way. <laughs> let's go find another town to visit. <laughs> What's this town got going for it? They're isolated Duh. in the mountains. Everyone here is really, really old, but they eat lots of yogurt, so they've been living a long time. What are you talking about? <laughs> it's an Inspector Gadget episode. <laughs> <laughs> what? There's an episode in Inspector Gadget where there's, he goes to this town and everybody's really old, but they're also really strong and everything, and it's because they eat yogurt. <laughs> <laughs> and <laughs> you... This and I'm the only person that seems to remember it whenever I bring it up. <laughs> this is like how forever JG will remember the town in uh, Illusion of Gaia or wherever it was that uh, had uh, magical anti-racism bread. <laughs> <laughs> the time where everybody is racist and their cure for racism is to have you eat bread that means that you no longer have the characteristics that the racist people were correct that you had. It's episode 1x46 Old Man of the Mountain, I think. I think. It's this specific episode number, I think. <laughs> this town is gay, huh? Yeah, yeah, it's it's definitely that episode. I recognize this, this strong-looking lady. <laughs> Anyways, yogurt's, yogurt's great for you. It makes you strong. Oh, okay. There's your there's your lesson, everybody. Have you been to the city south of here? I just cannot understand a word spoken there. I have wondered what language. I have wondered what language to. Well, there you go. The town south of here wouldn't have been able to talk to anybody anyway. Yeah. Oh, wouldn't that have been a pip after you meant you spent all that time walking down there? Yeah. Legends say that the castle in the west is place to test courage i love testing courage what i like say? high test courage i saw a shiny object flying towards the east the east the fur out the spring was kidnapped oh no hey and we've got oh let's see an inn a dancer she got her leg out Unbelievable! You are outsiders, right? How did you get this far north? Oh! What's it say? Yeah, I would say... Um, Eros. I don't know why in this case, tickles me so much. In case you never figured it out, 
you would now be able to go back and talk to the talk to the brooms at Metoya's uh, cave. Yep. And find out about the special map uh, function. What's that broom up to? It's talking backwards. Oh, witch. All right, what magic can we get here? Let's see. Hazel. Cure four. You can't learn that, someone else. Cure what about harm four? Sorry. So let me, well, let me see spelling. what level cure four and harm four are. Yeah, this is level seven magic. This stuff is going to be pretty potent. Yeah, it's interesting too because we can cast. We have two slots for level eight already, but we can't use them. Oh, snap, son. Cure four restores all hit points to one character and removes status effects uh, except stone. So it's a double whammy. Yeah. Everyone thinks towering. Yeah, Nikurum Desert is a mirage. I, on the other hand, wonder. What? Legend says, oh. Legend says when you eat yogurt, you get really strong. Legend says the sky warriors flew about here and there from a castle high in the sky. You guys are the light warriors, though, so uh, it's a good luck with it. From the sky warriors. <laughs> yeah, we saw you, shining object. Get out! Oh, the flying castle. Maybe that's what's on the cover of the game. The cover of the game has an orb with a sword and an axe on it, right? And inside Is there the a reflection orb? inside the orb? It's a castle on some clouds. Yeah. Let me see. Yes, there was a professor that studied Le Finish. Le Finish? I guess we'll oh, have to find that. I'm assuming that that's what people in that town speak. All right, what do we got here? Cabins, houses, heels. Let's get some heels. Man, it's it's ridiculous that this late in the game, they're just like, yeah, we really only have one type of potion. Sorry, guys. Yeah, no, I'm like, there's not super heal. It's not like they have stronger potions up in this part of the country. This town is massive. It is. Hardy R, you are too late. I bottled the fairy and sold her to a caravan. Okay, so you're just an asshole. <laughs> well, I mean, I. <laughs> this and is that well. well be ordinary. <laughs> yeah. You might think that something's going on, but guess what? Too bad. Oh man, there's a whole little. Oh, there's some more magic there. Yeah, it's black magic. Uh, well, did we already? No, it was black and white magic. Nothing yeah. here. No, there's no fairy. Oh man, shortcut. She got sold to a caravan, as you may know. Spell oh. Caraland. Hmm. She got sold to a caravan. Ordinarily, caravans get sold to you at low, low prices with zero percent financing. <laughs> Only a fairy can draw Octiale from the spring. It's like sure. Oxyclean, but it's beer. Long live your beer. Oh, man. Look at this price of this stuff. Can you learn Zap? Sorry, you can't learn that. What about Quadruple X? <laughs> Project Quadruple X. Oh, and we got Exver. Fade wall and Exver. Wow. All right, should I be? I should probably t be telling you what these spells are, huh? Yeah, I mean, it's not like we can even afford them yet, but. No, Fade damages all enemies for 880 to 320 damage. So ah, apparently so that's. Fade, that's what Fade Coach Z was talking about. Yeah, these people are trying to harm you for 80 to 320 damage. It basically works the same as harm, except. At least according to this, it actually damages all enemies. It doesn't just damage undead. Um, Exfer removes one enemy's special defenses. Uh, wall protects all characters against all magics. Um, but Exfer removes one enemy's special defenses. Indicates this spell works for monsters when they cast it on you, but not when you cast it on them. Unless... 
Unless the bug has been fixed. The bug has been fixed. And what did it do again? It uh, removes uh, enemy special defenses. Ah. Now you were looking at uh, zap and quadruple X and stop. Stop holds all enemies. Uh, quadruple X is a more powerful version of rub. It kills one enemy automatically. And zap kills all enemies. I'm going to guess the odds on either of those working are pretty low. Oh, actually XXXX uh, is guaranteed to succeed if the enemy has 300 hit points or less. Which, at what point, Boba could punch them once as well. <laughs> well, probably four hits. Four punches. No, that's true. One, two, one, two. Mic check. Ooh, pro rings. So yeah, I got a pro ring. I'm going to sell these gloves too. Get that 24 gold back. Buy another pro ring here for... Uh, surf. And I'm wondering if... Like, I don't know. Is it good to get the pro rings for the other people? Well, hang on. Let me see what the deal with the pro ring is. Uh, While you're looking at it too, there's also... The only weapon they have for sale is a cat claw. Oh, I'm sorry, that's an error. Uh, let's see. Here they are, the order in which they appeared. Pro ring, the last? Oops. Okay, so pro rings. Pro ring. Handy dandy little artifact is the best possible gauntlet for a variety of classes, although I can't seem to figure out why. What? <laughs> Because they're super pro now, that's why. Man, sometimes fags, I just, I don't. So let's see. It protects the user by reducing probability of instant death attacks. So rub hmm. zap and quadruple X are less likely to work. It has an absorb rate of eight and an evasion of minus one. So here's the question. Is it going to be an improvement for Bobo? It can nice. be equipped by everyone in the game, including the Black Belt Masterclass. Let's see here. Absorb 26, evade 68. There are three pro rings that you can find in the game. So if you don't feel like buying pro ring for everybody. Oh, now I tells you. No, it's... um. It's really bad for for Bobo. Okay. Uh, so what was the weapon? It's oh, Cat Claw. Actually, let's check out Lucky fifty eight sixty. Let's see. All right, some improvement there. So the cat claw has a damage of 22 and a hit percent of 35. It can be equipped by a knight, or red wizard, or black wizard, or ninja, but uh, not any of these non-upclassed dudes. Mm. And also, I'm thinking your swords are already doing way way better damage than that. Uh, what was the amount? Oh, the cat claw? Mm -hmm. uh, it does 22 damage and has a, a hit percent of 35. Yeah, I think it's uh, already higher. All right, so I guess that's it for this town. we got to find this fairy somewhere, but other than that, there was apparently something that flew off to the east, which probably wraps around the world. Yeah. What else do we got going on here? Oh. Oh, I, is this waterfall have something to do with something? I'm pretty sure it does at some point. Here's another town that's hard to get to. Some of those hard to reach towns. Yeah. Wait, is that immediately south? Uh, no, it's to the... Um, right arrow direction. Oh, okay. Ah, this is the place. I knew there was a Water desert you could place. land on. Okay. 
doesn't seem like there's much use to uh, landing there, but... Uh... Oh, it's the Oasis. <gasps> you know what time it must be? Midnight at the Oasis. Hey, we can hey, buy a bottle. a bottle. Let's get out of here. Well, I didn't know I was doing that, but I did it. Yeah. And apparently I mean, it's I up and around. I... Yeah, now you got to go back and... I mean, you, you just solved a quest that you... Yeah. Just completely inadvertently, uh, you know, solved it. So you just got to go back and find that town again. I'm sure if I talked to an elf, they would have told me something along the lines of. I'm just curious yeah. what the rest of this. Uh, okay, that, that's that. Uh, there's another desert over here with a tower in it, maybe. Yeah. Yeah, there it is. That tower might be a mirage, though. There's a way to land I've... there. Yeah. All kinds of places to land up here. Where's this lead to? More desert. Oh, we could have gotten to this little pond the whole time, but that doesn't get us really anywhere. Oh, oh we could have come you know to this castle. You... Oh, yeah. You know what you want to do to get to that castle? Get in the boat. You want to use your regular boat. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And then, yeah, you can tell that the waterfall has something going on in it because it's got a glowy, glowy spot. And you know what? The tower in the middle of the desert doesn't have a glowy spot. Interesting. And then there's all these caves, which who knows what's in there. I sure don't. All right, let's head back to that town. Yeah, dog. This is adorable. I think Hazel's sneezing. Or not sneezing, he's snoring a little bit. I accidentally just crushed a townsfolk. <laughs> don't crush a townsfolk. We don't know why we need this uh, item. We but... don't know what Oxyale is or why we would need it, but we're about to have it. Yeah. Oh, the wrong way. Dead end, man. She's going to be like, I'm going to give you tons of money. I'll give you cash. I'll give you cash for my freedom. <laughs> yeah, I wonder if we look at the bottle right now, what happens? Oh, I wonder if we talk to the pirate right now, what happens? Nope. Pop. A fairy appears, then is gone. I wonder if she's going to appear in town now. We could have bought more bottles, too. Hardy R, ye are too late. Ye are kung fu. We should have bought like three or four bottles. Just keep popping out fairies. Oh, hey. There she be. The pirate trapped me in the bottle. I will draw ox ale from the bottom of the spring for you. Oh, thanks. Or Oxyale. I'm not sure. Thank you for saving me. Remember, Oxyale will give you air. I'll give you air. I'll give you air. Oh, okay. right. There, isn't there like a underwater? There's a cave that's underwater somewhere, I bet. Man, I gotta go my regular boat. Come on, we'll get into the boat. Come on, get in the boat. Where's this lead to? That leads to nothing, I believe. This is what B Select is so good for. A lot of nothing. Yeah, there's nothing going on over here. I'm curious, though. Like, what's the deal with this cave? What's the deal with this cave? Hey, a treasure. It's a cabin. All right. Is that a bat? Very nearly a net gain already. There's a dragon oh, walking hey. around. Only the courageous ones bring back the proof of their courage. Mm, I'm a dragon. Hmm, I think I'm a dragon. Oh, man, some Gs. 30 gangsters. Soft. And soft. Oh, that's pretty cool, I wow. guess. Hey, there's dragons down over there, too. They're part of this... This is like this Dragon is Town. Let's bring it on up. Let's bring it on down to Dragonville. Yeah, I guess so. Oh, we gotta. This one's Trixie. We gotta, we gotta park it over there. We are going to the castle of Ordeal to the northeast. 
There we will test and bring back proof of our courage. Hmm, interesting. Courage. Courage. Hey, this is a well. Nothing here. Yeah, I mean, that well is so ordinary that uh, it doesn't even get dialogue. <laughs> like wells usually do, they get to talk. Yeah. But once in the north, it was beautiful palaces and big mechanical castles. Then hey, we quit broke stealing that our, shit. Our, our, hey, I got a house. Nothing here. Don't walk on those. You can walk on the skulls all you want, but the proof of your courage might be anything. Get out of my way. Oh, Ooh, I stole this 4G. Maybe 4G is the proof of my courage. Proof of courage. I, I stole this from a dragon. Come on. That's pretty courageous. Manticore. Oh, no. The Manticore is dead. Bye. Hey, remember the Manticore? Yeah, he's dead. Oh no, a worm. With a Y, just like in Wales. W Y R M. Everybody do the worm. An important distinction is he did not have the same amount of legs as a dragon. Well, okay. 800 gangsters. 582 gangsters. Well, there's a lot of gangsters gangsta. here and a lot of skulls. Makes you feel yeah. like the dragons are going to eat you, but then they don't. <laughs> hey, there you go. You're not afraid of me? Well, then I'm impressed. I'm so not afraid of you, I'm going to steal all of your treasures. Like, this is where they should have programmed if you take all the treasures and talk to him again. He's like, you should have been. You're fighting yeah, a like, dragon. <laughs> it, tricks, it trips a battle. Operation Trip Traps a Battle. I think can't this is the right last on one, is it? Yeah, no, you can't just, like, fly your airship in there. There's actually two more left. Oh. Have you met Bahamut, the Dragon King? He honors those with courage as true warriors. Oh, man, I was like, this got to be something. Man, you got the That's most all for this cave. island, kid. Move along. <laughs> oh, this is this one's got a double oh, yeah, me. here. Oh man, that's a long hallway. You're in this long hall. Oh, you're going even farther. This must be where Bahamut the Dragon King is. Yeah, I'd say so. <laughs> this is Bahamut's room. <laughs> if there's a sock on the door, don't come in. Yeah, Bahamut verifies the courage. True courage of all. Well... I am Bond, the king of the dragons. Bring me proof of your courage to receive the honor due true warriors. No, I sound wasn't... just like the other king, but there's <laughs> only two kings in this game. <laughs> yeah, they've been uh, waiting forever for the prince's coronation in Elfland. Yeah. <laughs> like, I really don't understand like what they're waiting, but what he's waiting for. It's like, no, I'm not the king yet. If you're brave enough, try meeting the King of the Dragons, Bahamut. He'll be like, are you brave? And you'll say, I don't know yet. Unprofitable business is not a practice of the dragons of Cardia. Mm, yeah, we don't practice any business. That's why we don't have shops. Yeah, apparently. Long ago, dragons and humans lived and traded together. And then you just stopped showing up. Yeah. And now we're out of goods. Sorry. Now all we have are chests with unusual amounts of money in them. <laughs> Anywhere from four to three thousand. Six hundred thirty-five damage. Hmm. Please, Bobo, spare them. All right. Well, I mean, I think that's that's not quite time for a video. Where are we gonna head to? I think if you, I mean, is the next thing you want to do to try and prove oh. your courage with the uh, castle? There's an entrance at the desert thing now. So oh, we either no. can get to the desert thing, or we can bring our uh, our boat up here. Yeah. I mean, you want to just pad out a couple more minutes, you could go down, get the boat, bring it back up there. Take some, uh, take some nodos outside of the castle door. 
Oh, we're almost there. Almost there. I went the long way around, you know? Yeah, you took the long way home. I distinctly remember way back in the day doing this little... Oh, yeah, you gotta come back down here and land. And the, the boat always sucks because then you gotta get in fights. It's, well, but, and also it seems so fast when you first get it and when you're cruising around on the world map until uh, you get the airship and then you're like, oh, no. Pretty crappy. And yeah, then you get used yes. to the speed again and you're like, eh. But also we could have come to this cave much earlier in the game, so it's really too bad we didn't explore. Oh, yeah, we could have gone to the castle, the, past, the palace of ordeal a long time ago, I guess. Well, as soon as we had the canoe, I guess. Which isn't it's technically before the Volbano, but I don't think anyone yeah. would really explore before the Volbano. What's in here? Nothing. N nothing, dog. Oh, these are sphinxes. Is, Watch out. These are, they're getting tougher all the time. It's just like... I mean, never any story with those oracle things. Yeah, they're doing pretty good damage, I guess. I mean... He ran what? away! He's like, oh, you're going to attack me with more than one guy? Fine, I'm out of here. <laughs> Must have been low low on health or something. Unfair. I mean, I guess they're only doing 19 damage to Hazels. They're like, oh, crap. I punched, I punched a white mage and he barely flinched. I better get out of here. <laughs> These guys are badasses. Hey, it's a guy! Possession of the crown is required to test your courage. Take it to the royal throne and bring back proof of your courage. Good luck. Oh, and he's gone. See ya. Oh, man. Um. Yeah, we we're it? actually all still pretty good with health. And, we uh, never gave it back. Oops. <laughs> all right, well, I guess. I might as well check out the treasures here. Oh. Oh no! All right, next time. <laughs> Turns out sitting on the on the throne gets you warped. Um, and you would have thought that that's how you would have found the floater instead, but no. Next time we'll okay. be going through this uh this warpy warpy loo to prove our courage. I'm Zerfall. I'm Bubba the Vulture. And we'll see you guys there. Bye.